This is the four element Yagi antenna ready for delivery to Sir uh, Lunilo. So before we package the item, let's check the SWR of this antenna. So the tuning stub is marked with tape, so you just need to put back the tuning stub on in between those tapes, marking tapes. So make sure when you install the antenna, make the check the connection if it's fully secure and no loose on the screws. So make sure that you tighten this nut for the SO239 feed point and secure the PL259 at the back of the antenna so this is now connected to the SWR meter let's check the SWR response on your operating frequency First, let's check the low power output. Let's switch to calibrate position. This is 5 watts. Calibrate the SWR. Press the PTT and set the detection. Okay, we have zero defle uh, full deflection on 145.060. Let's check to the SWR. Move the switch to SWR mode and press the PTT. As you can see, we are transmitting and the SWR is 1 is to 1. So let's check the full power output. Let's uh, first check the power output of this 5 watts. It's really 5 watts. We are on power mode, then forward power. Uh -huh. Press the PTT. So we have 5 watts full power. So let's check the 75 watts SWR response of the antenna. Let's move the power output to high. <coughs> that is 75 watts. High power. So first, let's check the power output. Move the SWR switch to 200 watts. As you can see, we have 75 watts of power on high power so let's calibrate the SWR meter move the switch to calibrate position press the PTT we have okay let's zero or put it on the full deflection we are transmitting on 145.060 at 75 watts. Calibrate position is now full deflection. So let's switch to SWR mode. Switch the SWR to SWR position and press the PTT. As you can see, we don't have any deflection on our needle, so we still have 1 is to 1. SWR on 145.060 at 75 watts uh, full power. Thank you for watching.